Hi guys, this is Kate. Um, I wanted to do an unboxing video. As you can see, I've already opened the box. I did um, go ahead and cut the tape and I opened it just to make sure that everything was right with personalization. There was one little issue and we will talk about that. Um, but I wanted to show you guys the monthly deluxe planner and everything else that I got in this little Erin Condren haul. So here's my box. I did cover up the address and everything. Um, as always, I love their packaging the little enjoy and the beautiful boxes. Um, I do reuse these when I send care packages to my niece who's in college and some other um, packages if I send anything to people. It's really cute to have these boxes and they ship really well. So I like that. Every time you open an Erin Condren box, you do get a couple things. You get a gift label, put that in the frame, and then you get a postcard. So I always save those. I have a stash of gift labels and cards and things like that. So those are great to have. I love having those in every purchase. Packaging is always nice. I did rip it a little bit when I was opening it last night to check on personalizations and personalization and things like that. But um, this is how it comes. Beautiful tissue paper and enjoy sticker. And then you can peel that carefully. Open. Always nicely bubble wrap, which is great. So I ordered some stickers first. This sheet was for my mom. Um, the little personalization issue I had was that these first three columns here were supposed to all be red and say soccer because my sister's school color is red. So they didn't come that way. So I've already emailed customer service. I've had a few other small issues in the past and customer service has always been great about fixing them. So I'm really not worried. So hopefully soon we will have a sheet that has all three columns that say soccer in red. So there's that. The next sheet I got is one of her new sticker sheets that she came out with when she launched the Academic Edition and Working in Education. I think these are super cute. So I'm going to use these for some monthly layouts and then just throughout my planner. So I really love these stickers. I like the primary colors. So I'm really excited about this sheet. I got another sheet that was kind of similar. And this one I actually love. I wasn't sure how I was going to feel about it. I'm going to take it out of the plastic so there's not as much of a glare on it for you guys. So. There's this one. I really love these. I think they are so cute. So I wish I would have gotten a second sheet, but maybe on my next order, I'll stick another sheet of these in there. Maybe even get the cover that goes with them because it's super cute. So I really love all the stickers I got in this haul. Um, I got the dots sheet, which is just really cute and fun. So that'll make for a cute, simple layout. I did get a sheet that coordinates with a cover I got on my planner. So this is like a dark gray and a light pink so those are fun you can pick your colors on these and it's so hard there's so many choices so to pick a background color and um, the design color is just difficult sometimes but these are really beautiful and I love gray and pink together so that's fun the next two things I got are the monthly deluxe planners and I'm going to take them both out and move the box out of the way so that we can really have this space here so first, I got a 2019 calendar year, and y'all, this cover, camera's just not even doing it justice. It is beautiful. The foil accents on it are gorgeous. There we go, it's picking it up a little bit. Um, it's just a beautiful cover, and I did go with the colorful for this one. Um, so you can see some of the detail there. Let's do a quick flip through. This is what the colorful looks like. So these sheets are really rich, saturated color. The tab sheets are a little thicker than the regular paper. But y'all, the paper in these is just luxurious. You can feel how amazing it is. And each month is a two-page spread of the calendar. Move that one out of the way so it lays flat. And then you have notes pages. So you have two facing pages and another two facing pages before you go into the next month. And then it'll switch color scheme. You can tell by the flag up here. You have another lined page and then you go into the month. So you have your monthly calendar view. And at the end of that, you have a notes section. So your tab says notes. Oh, and you have this next year's calendar. So like what's coming in the coming year. I love to have that for some forward advanced planning too. And then in the notes section, you can do 40, 80, or 120 line pages. So for this one, I think I just did 80. And I do count that as like one, two, three. So it's, you know, the facing pages are counted as a page. So this one sheet is counted as two pages. But this paper is so thick and so amazing that 
this is 80 pages, so 40 sheets of paper, and that is super thick. I love the quality on Erin Condren paper. It is just amazing. And then as always, you have two sticker sheets in the back. And I like how the colors alternate and they go with the color scheme of the months, so just super cute. And then you have your big pocket and your little pocket, and the inside cover is a wet erase or a dry erase dashboard. So that's a very, very quick flip through of the deluxe monthly um i did get another one for myself this one originally was going to be for my mom and then i found out that she doesn't like the seven by nine size she likes the eight and a half by eleven so i may let her see it um decide if she wants it i was going to give it to her for her birthday in october and if she doesn't i can very easily gift it to somebody else during the holiday season um this is the one i got for myself I love the Deluxe Monthly. I do use an Emily Lay Simplified Daily Planner as my regular planner, but the Deluxe Monthly I'm gonna use this year for some personal things and just to keep our home calendar. Um, and I did add a lot of extra pages into this one. I went with a full 120. Um, the covers do snap on and off, so you can change it out. So you can see it just snaps right in there. But I like this cover that I chose. This is that gray and pink that those stickers coordinate with. So you can see how those go together. I did it opposite for the stickers, so I think that'll be super cute to do a layout one month. And I went with the neutral in this one, so it's more black and white. I still think it's beautiful. And the reason I went with that, you do still get color, as you can see. You still get a lot of color, um, but the colors are a little bit more muted. They don't take up as much of the space. You can really do what you want with it and be a little bit more creative, I think. Um, you can see there's still some color but it's largely black and white. What I love about this one is the months. Again, the reinforced tab pages. I just think that this monthly layout is gorgeous. I love the simple, clean lines. I love that you can do what you want with it. I do wanna show you guys a quick comparison. So I'll flip to January because this is academic year. So this one goes from August through um, July for the 18, 19 year because I just function on an academic year. And my mom functions on a calendar year, so I got her the calendar year. So just to show you the difference in the two. You can see that there's so much more color at the top of the colorful. Um, let's do it this way so both can get in the frame. There we go. Kind of. So you can see the difference in the boxes. There's full boxes on this one with all four sides of the boxes drawn in. You do have a thicker color bar at the top, whereas the neutral is more neutral. Still a little bit of color, but for the most part, just a very neutral layout. And on the facing page, um, kind of the same thing. The color bar at the top, and this says notes right here. Like I said, you pointed it this way. This says notes right here over your column, and on the neutral it does not it's just blank space i do love that in both this year there's a little calendar for next month down in the corner so that you can look ahead so that's really great um, the one that i got does have of course the notes in the back so this can be used also kind of as a notebook and i did go with the max 120 pages so this is what that looks like and it is all that same quality paper this is the mohawk paper and it is just an amazing quality it's a bright white it's very thick, a nice heavy weight, um, has kind of a texture, like a tooth to it. So I just love it. And I love this woven wonder. I didn't like it at first. And then I saw it in the neutral with more of the white background. Um, let me see if I can find the navy background compared to the white background to show you guys. So here it is in the neutral where it's on white. And here it is on the colorful where it's on navy. So you can see the difference. And I do like the navy now that I see it in person in the colorful, but it was not my favorite when I saw it online during sneak peeks of the life planner. But now that I see it in the white, I just adore it. I even got an address book that has the Woven Wonder cover in the white. So I'm a neutral girl when it comes to my planner. I really love this one. I think it's gorgeous. The paper is amazing. I will do a pen test and test out some different types of pens on this paper, and I will post pictures on my Instagram at katiejplans. I'll drop a link in the description of this video 
for um, Erin Condren if you've never ordered before so you can get $10 off and when you order I also get $10 so thank you for doing that. I'll also drop a link to my Instagram so you can check out pen tests and kind of how I'm going to use my planner things like that. So that's what was in this haul. I mainly got it for the monthly deluxe planners and then of course just threw in some stickers. So that's what we got. Hopefully I will get in touch with uh, or they will get back in touch with me soon about my stickers and we can get the right color on those sticker sheets. But there you go, a haul of planners and stickers. That one's my favorite. How beautiful. Bye guys, thanks.